Hello, everybody, and welcome to my tour of the Premium Aria Suite, room 14173 on MSC World Europa. This room can actually sleep six people. You have two bunk beds to the side here with a sliding drawer. We ended up only having two people. Our daughter had her own room with friends, but she'd come in and stay with us one night. This room is massive. This might be one of the best rooms I've ever stayed in. For more of like a studio style suite, to the left here you have the lights. You do need a card so they work, it's eco-friendly. This room does have a shower and tub combo, which is a nice feature, just a warning if you are tall, the shower is still gonna feel quite short for you. My husband's six foot and said that it felt very short for him, just for frame of reference, but good size bathroom. As you'll see here, the main living part of the room is nice. On embarkation day, MSC puts out these mats which is a really nice touch so you're not getting dirt from your luggage while you're unpacking on there. Huge floor to ceiling mirror. The couch does have a sleeper in it and you can fit two in there. This is the vanity area, a few different shelves. There is a mini bar bottom left, some drawers. This room comes with two closets. I didn't even come close to using my closet space on this week long cruise. Granted, I did a capsule style wardrobe, but I still had a ton of room in there. Here's a quick look at the mini bar. Now remember, this is not included in your fare. This is extra. At the end of the cruise, they will bring a little receipt to you with everything you've used out that you have to sign off on for it to be added to your bill. Again, here's a look at the sleeper sofa. As you can see, tons of room. We were not sure on space. Now we're gonna go out to the balcony area. We did have neighbors with us, traveling with us, so we were able to get the balcony door opened up in between our staterooms. We were sailing out of Barcelona for this trip, so very, very beautiful background for this, but these doors do open. You have to request for them to be unlocked. You cannot open them yourself. The balcony was a pretty good size when we had them both opened up. It was a real treat. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out my other cruise room tour videos and other travel vlogs. I will see you on the next one.